between the lines. Three, two, one, go! The Red Alliance on this match is Carson. They're leaving two Gnome Hatch Panels off of their cargo ship. That's a potential two additional points to their scoring cap in this match here on Energy. Coming out of the sandstorm, we do see that one of those cargo has been sealed in. That was on behalf of Nightcrawler 2052. Making their first appearance over here on Energy, we see 5050 Cowtown Robotics of your Red Carson Alliance. They grab a hatch panel, zoom it on over to a Red Alliance rocket. They'll be dropping it off on level one for two points. The Force team in blue, they play some tight defense against Wild Sang. Wild Sang is safe back in their loading station for now, but Force team waits right behind them. Checking out the blue side of the field, Subington's Cyber Knights with some cargo. They're going to swerve around the defense from Nightcrawler. They raise their elevator. Their manipulator luckily able to swivel around so that they can avoid the defense and simply turn their manipulator to drop off cargo into the cargo ship. That's going to be a huge help for Cyber Knights as long as Nightcrawler is going to continue sticking to them. Robo Jackets now up in level two for a Blue Alliance rocket. Your score is 55 for your Curie Alliance, 37 for the Carson Alliance with just over one minute remaining in the match. Cyber Knights once again using their creative manipulator to beat the defense from the Red Alliance. Back on the scoring red side of the field, we do have plenty of hatch panels and cargo installed so far. It looks like the defense from the Force team is slowing down both Wild Sang and their alliance partner, Cowtown Robotics. Wild Sang momentarily pushed all the way to the blue side of the field. They are still attempting to score a hatch panel, but rather some cargo. It is still in their manipulator. They are finally able to line up in front of a null hatch panel. That cargo bounces on in. The Force team, the blue defensive bot, momentarily motionless. They are now back to playing that defense for the blue alliance. Southington still working hard for the Cyber Knights over on blue as well. With 20 seconds left in the match, Blue Alliance member Robo Jackets sealing up an entire blue rocket on their own. Southington is going to make their way back to the HAB. The Cyber Knights raise their bumpers above onto HAB level three. Meanwhile, on the red right side of the field, we've got one robot in three, one and two, and one and one as time expires. Check out these final scores. The winner is the Blue Alliance. Curry takes it home in 99 to 78. All right.